is Steve, and today we're going to talk about photo cards, membership cards versus a key fob. Which one should you use? If you're a health club or a Parks and Rec, rec Center, somewhere where someone comes to a central desk and you have to uh, bring them, you know, make sure they're a legitimate member of your, of your club or organization. Um, so traditionally people have used photo ID cards. So you know that you know this is the person whose card it belongs to. It doesn't become a community pass. Um, the other time you'd want to use the ID card is if you had other facilities and you don't have the ability to check them in or separate computer systems at those facilities. So that's when you go with the photo ID card. Um, if you have one central facility where you can check them in and their photos are in your software so you can check it's the person that you want, you can do a key fob. This is a tra traditional size. Put a barcode on the back so you can just scan it in. Um, some of the other variations of these are to do a thumb notch um, design where you have a barcode on the back and it allows them to hold it without taking it off their keys and swiping it through the reader. We can also make up uh, any kind of custom card that you want and on these cards it has a magnetic stripe on the back and another thing another variation of that is we can do two a card and a key fob if you want your members to have both and again barcodes on the back or we can do magnetic stripes on the back and um, so that's how you can kind of decide between a card a photo card and key fobs and today's mugshot is Lindsay Lohan and she has had more than one mugshot I can guarantee you to reach ID Edge call us at 798-3343 or go to the web at www.idedge.com